Hello everyone, I welcome to the session four on Python basics. So today we'll be covering the flow control statements such as if statement, else statement, else if statement, and while loop. So the first flow control statement is if statement. An if statements clause that is condition will be exe will be executed and it will be having a block of statements which will be executed if the statement condition is true. The clause is skipped if the condition is false. So the syntax of the if statement in Python looks like this. The first if keyword followed by the condition. It can be enclosed within a parenthesis or it can be as it is. So the condition can be an expression which are combined with the relational operator and the comparison operator which will be evaluated down to a Boolean value. If the condition is true, then the set of statement below the if statement will be executed. So if followed by the condition and colon will be represented. So this is the if statement syntax. So we don't have any curly braces to enclose the set of statement which will be executed if the condition is true. We'll be following the indentation method. In Python, there is no curly braces to represent a block of code. So instead of that, we'll be having an indentation. So all the statements which belongs to the if statement that will start with the same indentation. That is statement one and statement two will start with the same indentation. So the flowchart of the if statements look like this. This is an sample code for if statement. If name is equal to the allies, then print hi Alice. So the first start, and we have a diamond shaped where which represents the, the comparison or the condition. If the condition is true, then it will print hi Alice. Otherwise, it will be the program will be end. So here, if name is equal to Alice, colon will come print hi Alice. What is the else statement? So the else statement will be having some set of instruction that is a block. It is also called as a clause. The else clause is executed only when the if statement condition is false. The syntax of a if else statements of the flow control in Python looks like this. If condition followed by some set of statement, then the keyword else followed by a colon and some set of instructions. So we have both the clause related if the condition is true and also the, the clause related to the if the condition is false. Let's take the same example. If name is equal to Alice, print Alice, else you'll be printing hello stranger. We don't have any curly braces. So it starts with the same indentation. We are not supposed to start the print statement exactly below the if then it is not considered as a part of the if. So you give some spaces. So indentation will be a little bit reduced to write the set of instructions. Start, if the name is equal to Alice, then print hi Alice. If it is false, then you'll be printing hello stranger. So this is a flowchart related to the else statement. Else if. So it provides another condition that is checked only if all the previous condition were false. At the part, at the else part, we have one more if statement to check for another condition. If condition, then some set of statements, then we have a else if. So what is else if is nothing but at else, again, we are checking for one more condition, okay, where the program can check for more than one possible conditions, then statement three and statement four will be executed. The keyword which will represent the else is E-L-I-F. S-E is missing. Let's take the same example. If name is equal to Alice, then print hi Alice. Then again at the else part, if this condition is not true, then it will come to the else. And in the else part, we have one more condition that is one more if statement is there and we can print you are not Alice Hido. So what is the meaning of this is 
this is a nested if or it is a ladder of if else statement you can continue in any level so let's look at the flow chart we'll start from the start and the name the user will enter the name if the name is equal to alice then you will print hi alice and it will be come out from the if statement if the condition is false again we have one more condition that is is age is less than 12 if the condition is true then you are not alice kiddo and it will be printing it will be coming out from the if statement and you will say end so this is about the else if so any level this if else if, if else if can be continued while loop a block of code executes over and over again using the while statement so in this will be checking for a particular condition if the condition is true then the same block will be executed and again and again the code in a while clause will be executed as long as the while statement condition is true the syntax of the while loop is while followed by the condition and colon and we will be having the clause or you can also say a block of statement so this will be executed till the condition is true once the condition is false the execution will come out from the while loop let's take an example so i've taken a, a variable spam spam is equal to a zero while spam is less than five colon so the condition here is spam is less than five we have used a comparison operator where the spam will be compared with the five each and every time if the condition is true then we'll print hello world and the spam will be incremented to plus one and again the execution will be continued if you look at the flow chart of the while loop it will start first you'll be comparing is the spam is less than five it's true then the clause related to the while loop will be executed over and over so print hello world then spam is incremented to one from zero it will become one and again the execution will be continued again and again if the condition is true 